What up, YouTube niggas? It's uh, it's your boy PK, aka PK DJ O O Munchies, aka we take tests high, we study high, we get high scores, aka the breeder gang boss man run with us, he can run the fuck over. So I got a uh, a battle for y'all. It's uh. I was, yo, I was fucking high as shit, and I played out of my mind, I played so good, so perfect, so pristine, that I just needed y'all to see this, so, uh, anyway, uh, we got the team preview, I think he's got a Specs Latios, the standard Life Orb, Bolt Beam, Hydro Pump, Rapid Spin, Star Me, a, uh, SD, Life Orb, Mach Punch, Seed Bomb, Bullet Seed, Breloom, Standard Choice Band, Scissor Man, the uh, most used Pokemon in the game, period. Uh, Scarf Chomp and a Magnezone to make a way so that uh, the aforementioned threats can sweep freely late in game. Now, my team, I got a specially defensive Celebi going to lose to the, the Scissor with the whole U-turn pursuit stuff. I got a specially defensive Big Black African Hippowdon that's going to lose to that... Uh, Life Orb, Stabbed, Hydro Pump, Specially Defensive, Scissor, no superpower, so Magnezone is going to shut that down. It might get one for Ven Kill and then die. So, yeah, Scissor won't do shit. I got a bulky Breloom, take any hit from any Garchomp except for the Choice Banded ones. But I still, I have uh, over a 50% chance to live those. I have a uh, Specially Defensive, Heatran with Earth Power, Toxic, and Protect. And I have a uh, Moxie, Mango, Scarf, Naughty, Mints. That late game sweeper, he picks up the broom and he cleans shit up. So, uh, big ups to Mega. Shout outs that guy. Sub, like, comment, subscribe, all that shit. So, I'm going to leave with my Celebi to counter the Breland lead. And um, he ends up leading with Latios, which is the other lead that I thought he could lead. But now I can bait the Draco, the Trick, or the HP Fire. So, it makes Heatran a relatively safe switch. So, I'm going to see what kind of player he is. I'm going to go into my Heatran. He shows me the Trick. And I was like, oh, what the fuck? You got Trick. Because nothing on my team wants a choice that we all have lefties. But knowing that uh, he can surf me for free, probably hit my Hippo, predicting me to switch into his Magnus. I'm going to stay in. And I'm going to give him... Uh, that PIV, that Pokemon immunodeficiency virus. So uh, he's going to die slow because he's not Magic Johnson. You heard? So uh, now I know that since I'm locked in a Toxic, he's probably going to switch into Magnezone. Hold on, let me spot this one. So uh, I'm going to switch it to uh, that big black hippopotamus. I should have dated Rick Ross, but then it would have to be a dude, big black nigga, you know what I mean? And no icy watch. We got Sandy backs. But uh, that's still Rick Ross. Uh, but uh, yeah, so uh, the double switch number one. Um, and uh, now I know he's like, ooh, Earthquake is obvious. So I'm going to use Stealth Rocks. And uh, I get Sand and I get Rocks without losing any momentum. So that's pretty good, I think. I think, I think. At this point, I'm feeling good. I'm like, ooh, I predicted. I predicted. I know what's going on. I can play. I'm not a scrub after all. So now I'm going to show him that, look, nigga, you're not better than me. So I'm just going to, like, hop in the Lazy Boy get lazy on this nigga and start slacking off because we slackers we we like we skip school all the time and um yeah so i'm gonna go all the way back to full i'm gonna let the uh the piv slowly uh cripple his immune system plus one is sandstorm so i mean you know you, you never want to be in a sandstorm with a uh a weakened immune system that's why some people live in a bubble but uh anyway back to the battle we got all these after turn effects uh i think he's gonna think that i'm gonna whirlwind him and knowing that i think that i could whirlwind him i'm gonna um slack off again because we're lazy as fuck and um so yeah so i did like half to this latios and i haven't even attacked it yet so he's gonna take uh three turns of sand, which is uh like eighteen percent. He's gonna take three turns of toxic, which is thirty six percent. So uh, if you add that up, it's uh I don't know, maybe not. But um yeah, so he's he's down to like half, and I haven't hit him yet. So uh the obvious breloom is obvious, so I'm gonna obviously go for the earthquake because he has levitate, and that's a retarded thing. You never want to earthquake something with levitate, so I hit the breloom because, like I said, I played out of my mind. I'm so high I can see the future, so I'm gonna go into this Celebi just to uh, wall the shit out of breloom, and uh, he shows a low sweep, so I'm happy because I'm like, yeah, choice man to breloom. I can I can handle that. But then um, something weird happens, and I see the life orb. So I'm like, okay, you don't have Swords Dance. I can really handle that now. 
because uh yeah so his breathroom is down like under half and uh okay that's cool so now that he's faster than me i'm pretty sure he's gonna go for the spore so i'm gonna stay in hope for that first turn wake that zero percent chance to wake up first turn but uh yeah so okay so i just finished rolling this blunt and i'm so high at this point that i can see the future i'm thinking that i don't have any seed in my weeds so i'm thinking this breloom he smokes that reggie bush so he wants to get rid of all his seeds so i'm gonna go into scissors because that's the best thing i have and and he doesn't even like dirty weed like ew so he's actually offended that this breloom is like throwing all his seeds out on him and right but breloom ends up doing like a third which is funny because if you can like three hit ko scissors quad resisted you're a fucking monster yo breloom is a monster man <laughs> my bad uh smoke break but uh yeah so all these residual things happen so uh i'm gonna make double switch number two because i can and the obvious switch to latios was kind of obvious well i don't know maybe maybe it was obvious maybe he double switched on me i have no idea but the thing is now worst case scenario is uh if he dracos me i gain four hp and uh, at 305 HP, I can live max damage hydro pump followed by max damage ice beam from a life orb star me and recover and not die to sand. So, yeah. So, I go for the recover as he Dracos, but he misses. But like I said, worst case scenario, I gave 4 HP. So, it really did matter. And he would have to switch after the Draco anyway. So, what I'm going to do here is... uh. I'm gonna predict the scissor to come in, so I should just switch straight out to Heatran. Except I'm a baller and I like to play mind games and I'm PK DJ. What fun is it if I don't troll niggas? So uh, I'm the most gangster Pokemon nigga ever. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna reveal that I have Baton Pass to fuck with his mind, cause I like mind games. And uh, now that he knows. That I know that he knows that I have baton pass. He can think he can pursue me for free. Because I won't baton pass. I'll stay in thinking that uh, he'll do something weird. Because I revealed it. But uh, he ends up switching. So I know that he doesn't have speed on his scissor. So he is in fact choice banded. And uh, the only thing on his team he has to take a specs lava plume is the star me. But a little ass star me gets... Uh, gets clean the fuck out by that lava plume clean to a ko clean and um he misses the hydro pump but like i said even if i was at 305 hp if he would have hit the hydro pump then he would have hit the ice beam i still would have recovered he probably would have committed suicide in the process and i'd be back to at least half so i'm gonna baton pass again because the obvious switch is obvious like and i can take an ice beam if he wants to stay in so uh like I said before, I can take any outrage from any Garchomp except a Choice Bandit Chomp. And I have 55% chance to live if it is a Choice Bandit Chomp. So I'm going to stay in. I'm going to go for the uh, HP Ice. If he is banded, I can Revenge Kill with Mets. Um, he ends up being banded. And I live with 1 HP because... Right. I was born with one HP, fucking two pounds and 11 ounces. You know what I mean? Let's go and preemie babies for the win. But uh, yeah, so I raped this thing with HP ice, like no lube, straight anal in the showers, MCIJ style. And um, now I bring in my scissor. I could just revenge it with a bullet punch. But what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to set up a swords dance to ensure that Magnezone doesn't come in. Because when you see swords dance, you think fucking jolly max speed swords dance scissor with superpower which outspeeds magnezone that's not scarf so not only will i scare the shit out of his magnezone from coming in but if it does come in i know it's scarfed and i don't give a fuck because i have scarf chomp so or scarf mints um that mango moxie mints nigger so if my mind games paid off magnezone won't come in and oh shit magnezone doesn't come in but now I'm thinking his Breloom is jolly because why would you bring it in on Scissor to set up a Swords Dance? So, um, predicting the jolliness, I'm going to go into my Celebi because 
yeah, I can do that shit all day, every day. And um, finally, because I've been dying to know, are you jolly, you adamant? I see that he is, in fact, jolly Breland. But then, his Breland turns out to be one of these fucking little-ass 90s baby emo niggas. So he commits suicide, which is okay. So now that he knows that I know that he knows I have baton pass, I'm going to baton pass because that's what you do. You reverse the Omi. The smart play is dumb, and the dumb play is smart. And then, what happens? I baton pass on a pursuit. So, yeah, that was a little bit swaggerific. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a, a tad. A tad fucking awesome. So, uh, the only thing he has, I guess, now to take Specs Lava Plumes is a uh, this little ass Latios, which is you know that nigga had AIDS for the longest time, so uh, he was just glad I put him out of his misery. So when it comes to Stormy again, and uh, the thing with the all the misses and the, the whatever the fuck happened with the Stormy before, it wouldn't have been able to come in a rocks anyway. So yeah, I'm gonna switch in. And I'm gonna get like hit by this hydro pump, but like I said, at 305 HP, I could have lived this hit. And then the ice beam, and then recovered, and it yeah, it wouldn't have mattered. Like I, I'm still living. I live. Hold on, I need to spark the bob. <laughs> right. So now that we get high again, um, I mean, no, I'm just kidding. Don't do drugs. Drugs are bad. Uh, so Starby goes for the ice beam. I'm gonna end up recovering. And um, his star me turns out to be one of these little emo 90s babies too And it also commits suicide So I think at this point I've only attacked like four times HP Ice, Earthquake, and two Lava Plumes And uh, I killed three guys So that's cool, defense wins championships So now it's like, okay, you're either going to bullet punch me or U-turn So I'm going to go for the baton pass I'm going to sponge the... Uh, Bullet punch, get a free switch into my Heatran. And the only thing he has to switch is a Magnezone, which can't take a flash fire lava plume, which is uh, specs without flash fire, if y'all didn't know. And um, that's going to get cleaned out. And now I'm going to see if he's running any speed, which obviously he's not, or he would have gone for the superpower like a long ass time ago. And I'm going to win with uh, two more lava plumes. So thanks for the specs. And uh, yeah, so that's real Raymond. From uh, Smogin Wi-Fi Battle Finder. Yeah, I know I'm a little bit ahead of the narration, but I mean, obviously, y'all niggas know what happens. This is a heat train, choice specs, lava plume, that shit, murder scissors. So uh, once again, shout outs to that nigga Mega D P A L. D P A L. Anyway, that's that's my that's my guy. That's that's my guy for real for real. Uh, big ups to the whole breeder gang. Number Bumba. Ryuzaki, Mega, you honorary breeder gang as far as I'm concerned. You know how we roll no hazards, no spin and win games. Um, shout outs to d -Den, Danny, all y'all niggas. Link will be in the description. Real Raymond has a YouTube channel. That link will be in the description. I set up my YouTube shit, so uh, that link will be in the description. I don't, I don't upload. Other niggas upload when they lose to me or when they beat me. They upload my shit for me. And, um... I just got a playlist with all my little battles. You can watch me get smashed on. Um, question of the day. What's your favorite mega moment? Mine is a, a toss-up between his Ash Gray Let's Play Part 1. Thanks for waking me up, bitch. Uh, and uh, when this nigga was screaming, Earthquake, like 17 times in one video. That was that was kind of, that was pretty funny. Um, yeah, so, so that's PK. Um... Y'all niggas get at me. I'm your favorite battler's favorite battler. And, uh, yeah. Study how I take tests, how I get high scores. Play Pokemon, how I make high predictions. Holla. Oh, Montana, high as a rock. Kill low. Bitch, pussy, I'll pick. Move on. I'll take your whole top off. Too low. DJ Lazy K. K, K, K.